Our nation is undoubtedly the ultimate coffee-loving nation. Coffee has become a pivotal and periodic aspect of life for many Americans. It has become the second largest commodity after crude oil, and it is worth $100 billion worldwide. It is such a prominent beverage in society that many Americans have implemented coffee consumption into daily routine. Some people have their unique preferences memorized due to their frequent visits. For example, this gentleman portrayed in this following video. I need a triple shot decaf chai caramel latte. Decaf chai frapple, what? Many drink coffee to attain that surge of energy which warms the entire body and spawns a strong sense of concentration. Others merely enjoy the bitter sweetness in coffee that provides comfort and contentment. No matter the reason, coffee continues to remain as a meaningful beverage within our society. The following are some facts and important statistics pertaining to coffee and its consumers in America to show the importance and its influence on our nation. The U.S. consumes more coffee than any other country in the world, which is 18.2% of the world's coffee. Did you know that the U.S. imports about one-third of the world's coffee production? That's about $4 billion in coffee a year. Over 50% of Americans over the age of 18 drink coffee every day. The average American drinks 3.1 cups of coffee a day. Mm, I'm going to drink this every day. Americans consume 400 million cups of coffee per day, which is enough to fill up 14.2 Statues of Liberty. Studies have shown that 3 out of 5 Americans say, I need a cup of coffee to start my day. Additionally, research has shown that 68% of coffee drinkers have their first cup within an hour of waking up. As coffee comes in different shapes, tastes, and sizes, so does its consumers. Coffee is consumed by a wide variety of the American population, and there are some evident trends of these consumers. Coffee is less popular among the younger generations due to alternative products such as energy drinks. Coffee industries have responded by creating new flavors such as lattes and frappuccinos to attract these younger consumers. This graph shows how coffee consumption, for the most part, increases as age increases. Coffee consumption is most popular amongst the older generations. Another evident trend within coffee consumers is household income. As seen in this graph, coffee consumption directly increases as household income increases as well. Another trend is race. According to a recent NCA National Coffee Drinking Trends Market study, the Hispanics significantly lead the pack for coffee consumption. The study showed that 76% of adult Hispanic Americans said they drink coffee, compared to 64% of Caucasian Americans and 47% of African Americans. Additionally, studies have shown that coffee plays a different role in the lives of women versus the lives of men. Women have reported drinking coffee in order to relax, whereas men drink coffee to get work done. The powerhouses that currently control the American coffee industry are Starbucks, Dunkin' Donuts, Coffee Bean, and Tim Hortons. Yet within these names, the most ubiquitous coffee chain in North America is Starbucks. In 2013, 13% of American adults went to Starbucks, compared to 11% of Americans that preferred Dunkin' Donuts. Starbucks has more than 13,200 locations within the United States alone and 20,000 more branches in 62 other countries and has become the ultimate powerhouse of coffee as it successfully implements the Starbucks on every corner strategy in which Starbucks can be found on mostly every corner around the world. In conclusion, coffee plays a very important role in the American culture today. Many people from men, women, whites, Hispanics, Asians, elders, and millennials enjoy and appreciate this beverage on a day-to-day -day basis. Coffee is undoubtedly one of the most important beverages in our society today.